Welcome back to the Fuji guys, my name is Francis. Today we are gonna take a look at the brand new Instax Mini 9 from Fujifilm. We are going to take it out of the box and have a first look at it. So keep on watching. All right, so let's take a look at what's in this box. So let's open it up. All right, we have batteries, alkaline batteries, a wrist strap, the close-up attachment. We have here some Instax uh, information, coupons, depending on, on the country you're in, they'll be different. You have your warranty and uh, startup guide. And lastly, we have the camera itself. So let's just take this box away. The Mini 9 is available in different color options depending on which country you're in. Okay, so first up we are going to put the batteries in. So let's just open this up. And the Mini 9 uses uh, AA batteries, alkaline batteries. So just open up this door here first one and the second here close it up now if we look at the back we have our frame counter here the viewfinder and that's where you are going to put your film in so if we open this up and we take a pack of film So the Mini 9 uses Instax Mini Films. You have different options. You can have the standard color one, like this. You have the monochrome, and you have the specialty films with like uh, special frame borders or uh, colored borders, uh, like stripe and tiles, all the different ones. So. So if you look on, on the film itself, you have a, a yellow tab here. And if you look at the camera, you have a yellow tab there also. So just put the film yellow to yellow, close it up. Now we are going to power up the camera just by pressing on this button there. And you see the counters saying S now. And if I press one, just to remove the, the, the safety card, the black card, that's protecting the film from being exposed when outside the camera. Now, the film's inside. Let's put the wrist strap on the camera. So if you look on, on the side of the camera, you have two little holes. You just slide it in. And comes up the other side and then you just go like this and make it go through and there you have your strap attached so if we take a look at the front of the camera we have two little holes there these are sensors to measure the light so and, and if you look up there there's an LED that, that's moving around depending on the, the amount of light it's getting. So if I aim it at the light that's, that's uh, lighting me and then I hide the sensors, you see it goes back to the indoor mode because it's not getting enough light. Now, you wanna align the marker with the LED because this is going to open up or close down the aperture to give you the right exposure. If you put it to high key, then it's going to open up the aperture completely. So it's going to be a very bright image uh, if that's what you're looking for. So if I go and take a picture, I can take a selfie using this little mirror in the front to frame my shot. So if I take a picture. Frame is coming out and I can just let it go. One thing to mention, when the LED there is blinking, it's because it's actually charging up the flash. When it's not blinking, it means it's ready. 
And speaking of flashes and battery life and all that, with a set of batteries, you can go through 10 packs or 100 uh, pictures. Now, as you go on, it might take longer for the flash to recycle and have enough power to fire it up. So here I have my instant picture. Now, you see it's quite dark. It's because the backdrop is dark, obviously. Um, if we take a look at this little close-up uh, attachment there, take it out of the plastic, I can attach it right here. Now I'm just gonna close this so it's easier. Attach it like this and power it on. And you see the little mirror is still free to uh, look at myself. So I can take a, a selfie again, but closer. The, dis the working distance of the adapter is 35 centimeters to 50 centimeters. So you have a, a little range to make sure you're in focus. So if I go, Take it close up. Here we are going to let it process. Now I do want to mention, if I remove this, um, when you when you're aiming in the viewfinder, it's really important to realize that there's what's called a parallax. So I'm looking through there, but the lens is actually here. So if I take something that's further away then it doesn't really matter because it's gonna be centered. But as I get closer, I wanna make sure what I want in center is a little, bit, a little bit to the left of the circle because obviously if I get closer like this, I look there, I'm seeing this. And actually what I, I, I am having in my frame is actually this. So you wanna take that in consideration when you are taking pictures, close-up pictures. But again, if you take landscape or things that are further away, then you can just aim and use the, the center circle to frame your shot. So there you have it, my close-up picture. It's still processing a little bit, but it's looking good. Um, so, so there you have it, uh, the unboxing and first look of the Fujifilm Instax Mini 9 camera. And if you should have any questions, uh, please leave them in the comment section below. And if you wanna know more about Fujifilm products, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. Follow us on Twitter and Instagram. And until the next time, I'm Francis for the Fuji Guy. Mm -hmm.